right. Hello, YouTube. So, since last time, in case you uh, cannot tell, I have farmed up what I had for my quote-unquote starting gear for high rank. And now I have a second set, which kind of just turned out to be four pieces of basil. Because you get full critical draw and full earplugs. Because I figure if a monster roars and I'm charging an attack, kind of a pretty good thing to do. So yeah, and then also this gives me two focus. I didn't really look into how much I'll be able to get by the end of uh, high rank on for my charm, but I remember, um, I remember I only got two from my charm with charge blade. So yeah, but at this point, I feel like we're going to start off with going for Diablos. I don't know if I'll get this finished or not. I'm not too worried about it. Then we'll go hunt Basil. We might go hunt, like, well, we'll go hunt Aragon, I guess. Maybe an Elder Dragon. Probably go hunt some Rathalos. I'll figure it out as we go on. But first things first, I do kind of want to go hunt a Diablos. Because getting a charm will at least mean I always have at least one level of focus so yeah let's just go ahead and start with that which i think would be here yeah okay and uh all right before i get in this first hunt though if you watch us on youtube uh like and subscribe if you want to hang out live whenever i do these I do these every Monday, Wednesday, Friday at 7.30 Eastern over on Twitch. The link is in the description. Come on by, hang out, have a good time. And uh, yeah, I also would like to say um, thank you anyone who's uh, come by either like during the stream or just dropped a follow because there's been quite a few of you. So I appreciate that. But, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and, uh, see how this goes against Diablos. Alright, here we go. Hopefully it doesn't go too bad. I definitely want my free healing here. Oh, no black Diablos. That's nice. I'll take that any day of the week. Well, I don't know. Getting a turf war is kind of just free damage, but... I don't know. Yeah, I'm just gonna do that. I'll throw in Vitality Mantle right away. Didn't really want to do that, honestly. We'll just go for it. I think I can hit the tail. Eh, I hit the tail somewhat. Yeah, I'll just go ahead and do that. Thank you. Uh, I was trying to bait the tail swipe. Because that's definitely my biggest opportunity to... Like so. Boom. Nice whiff. Oh, 
on. Okay, so didn't I was hoping for a stagger. Didn't get it, but that's fine. Not too big of a deal. Tails tail swipe, no. Tail swipe, tail swipe, tail swipe. Yes. I'll just go behind them. Yeah, that's fine. Take my hit. Okay, let's see if I can get a tail swipe here. I can. A little unfortunate there. Okay, that's coming for me. side there and I thought about getting a set that had quick sheath on it but like I want earplugs like really bad because if I can get earplugs that's just a lot of extra damage just think about it, like any roar pretty much that's an opening Didn't get the full thing. Oh well. But yeah, just I don't know. It just kind of makes sense to me. If I get four year plugs, there's just more opportunity for damage. Because roars are some of the biggest openings in the game, really. Assuming you, like, can get through them. Nice. Ah, I was hoping I wouldn't get it by the tail there. There goes a horn, nice. That's kind of what I was hoping for there. And I'm blocking that shit. <laughs> Screw that. I ain't tackling through that. I don't know if I think I even could have really. Quite what I wanted, but I 
Tail swipe, tail swipe. I was trying to hold off, but I was afraid if I held any longer, he was just gonna go flying. If I held any longer, I'm pretty sure I would have just done the attack. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, I'm not able to do anything there. Swipe. Just want to make sure you're out of his range, basically. Damn. Oh well, we got the tail. Not bad. I gotta say, it's really nice not having to sharpen anywhere near as often as uh, other weapons. Because you just do like few, but really strong hits. So you're not- oh, I'm suddenly in yellow. Oh, I'm in orange now. Alright, let's see if I can do this. This is my first time doing this without evade, uh, evade extender, so... Nice. That's gonna hurt. That's fine though. Go ahead and get our heal over here. Yeah, whatever. It's fine. I was hoping he would come after me. I'm blocking. Oh my. I was definitely going for my pal to go in, or I guess, wasn't really going for anyone there, I guess. But uh, wasn't going for me, that became very clear. Nice. Not bad. Not bad. Felt pretty good. Considering it was Diablos for our first hunt in the part, not bad. Could have been way worse. Alright. Oh, no, I'm enjoying Grey Sword though. I 
I still think my top three right now is definitely dual blades, although I'm probably biased on that. But I can't really get rid of bias. <laughs> it's like dual blades, lance, charge blade. In that order. I think that's like undoubtedly what it is right now. Granted, I still have multiple other weapons I haven't played. You know, it it's uh, it, it's fun. Grant, no, oh, I got what I need for the charm. Nice. I have no idea what I forget what the upgrade is. Like entirely. All right, cool. Now we upgrade it. Well, oh, it's Valhazak. Okay. So I can probably get that by the end of high rank, but like, I'm not really worried about getting it. Because when you're fighting Elder Dragons by that point, I feel like once you're doing that, what's the big deal? Oh, yeah. I never bought the charms. That might be good to have. Those might be useful. <laughs> Just a little bit. Okay. There we go. At least have the charms now. Well, I guess. Hmm. I kind of want to hunt a little bit with our current loadout first before we go ahead and like... Train, I mean, you still gotta hunt... Oh, I didn't even realize that needs Uragon stuff as well, and Dodo Agama. Okay. But... Yeah, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and hunt some lower tier stuff. Before I like, head on upwards. Uh, so. Oh, I haven't hunted Kuliaku. Well, this is gonna be painful. For Kuliaku. But, alright, this shouldn't be too bad. I'll start central, I guess. Hey there. Finally have, uh,. Far casters forming a little bit. I hadn't even like thought about it. Uh, flash pods is right. Was I? Do I have flash pods going? I don't know. I have some at least. So I'll throw that. The less X's, the sooner, the better. Granted, I don't use the, like, the drinks until Master Rank, so, and I don't really get Ancient Potions until I use Steamworks, because uh, I'm not about to farm Kelby Horn, or, I forget what the other thing is. But, yeah, I'm not about to farm that stuff. Max potions are fine, but yeah. Though it'll still be a little bit until I actually use critical draw. But I feel like once I have it, I don't think it'll be going away. I'll probably just hold on to stuff until I get it again. Yeah.
Yeah, okay, I figured you would go f fast. What? That was damage. That was, in fact, damage. This is gonna hurt you way more than it hurts me. Okay, maybe not. Maybe it's not gonna hurt. Actually, no, it hurt me more than it hurt you. That helped me. That hurt me like emotionally. Yeah. That's fair. Dang, if only his tail went over a little bit further. I thought you were going this way, but then I remembered <laughs> right after I let go of Y that you have nothing, you don't have an area you fight in over there. <laughs> oh, damn it. That would have been good, too. Oh, well. From what I've played, I feel like missing true charge slashes is like. A rite of passage for anyone playing great sword is like if you don't you really aren't playing great sword let's be honest you will miss true charge slashes you will not like get used to it it'll feel bad every time but you will miss them yeah calm down Rathian all right just calm down I said calm damn that's not calm is not calm okay I'm feeling the I'm feeling the the focus on this I'm feeling the okay oh god but that last level you can feel granted I guess I kind of have been on focus too for a little while no you know what yeah you do that you do that Bye. Yeah, I don't even care. And you don't go to sleep anyway, you just crack eggs. Hey, that's still hit. Let's go. Right, 
Right, I think if you don't charge, you can't actually turn. Is he gonna hurt you? Oh, well, he's gonna kill you, actually, but... I mean, wasn't wrong. <laughs> wasn't wrong, it definitely did hurt him. But alright. Not bad, not bad. Keep in mind right now what the, I mean, I guess minus my charm, the hardest thing that I have equipped that to on like to get is my sword, I guess, because I had to hunt Rathian. Like, <laughs> the rest of it was low rank Rathalo stuff. So. Like, all this is easy to get. Because what, Bone, Hornitar, Sitsiaku, Jirotodus, Palumu. And then... And then just low rank Rathalos and high rank Rathian for uh, the Inferno sack, I think is what it was. I don't know, whatever the generic fire sack is for... Uh, high rank. I think you can get from Anjanath too. But, yeah. I don't know. But, that was a good hunt. Can't complain too much about that one. Um... Sure, let's go for Toby Kadachi, why not? See how that goes. Go there. What are my resistances? Okay, I'm weak to more things than I'm strong against. Nice. Anyways. Oh, we do like one or two more for the uh, Farcasters. So leave it six per. Pretty much. It's six per mission or hunt. Which ain't bad. Because I mean, you don't use those that often. I mean, I guess you can, but. It's not how I play anyway. In case you haven't like watched any of my playthroughs, you know, it's, if you've paid attention, I don't use, uh, well, I have like Vitality on pretty much all the time. And then it's like Glider or an Elemental Mantle. I don't use Temporal or Rock Study like at all. I'll take it. But yeah, I just I just think Temple and Rock City help form better habits when it comes to hunting in general. I like to you know think that I'm decent uh, evidence of that kind of working. Like, I'm not, like, amazing, mind you, but, you know, I got the job done pretty reliably, I feel like. Um, okay, well, 
Then we're Toby Kadachi, I guess. We'll go down the next area. area. Follow me. Rathalos can stay up there. Because he is enraged, so he should follow me. Oh, he's walked real slow. I expected him to jump, honestly. damage. No. Ooh, yep, there we go. Dang it! <sighs> Almost. Can you get close to this damn ledge? I said close. There we go. I just wanted a damn mount attack. My god. I know I had to do bigger quests than freaking Starfield to, to do uh, just a mount attack and actually get the mount. Jeez. Hey! <laughs> Jesus. Like, this era? Like, my god. Like, we gonna get this done my decade? Like, or like this decade? Like, at all? Like, uh... <laughs> oh, man. That mount took forever. Holy hit stun. Oh, I think, yeah, I needed one of those. For my weapon, too? Alright, cool. Granted, it's two from now, because I have the regular Rathalos, then the blue, then the Zerathalos. That's what that is. If you couldn't tell by the blue. But, calm down, I'll hunt you sometime. Seth, calm down, jeez. 
Some people. Y you done? Cool. <laughs> oh, man. Also, why is the metal on the back side of the Jirotodus legs pink? Like, that's the default color. Why is it pink? Like, that that doesn't make sense. Why, why is it pink? Like, in, ca in case you don't, like, believe me or anything. Like, you know, like, th this is what I'm talking about. Like, default color. Like, wh why is it pink? <laughs> Doesn't make sense to me. Either way. Um, let's jump up a little bit. Uh, let's let's talk about like Yana. Why not? Like Yana sounds fun. Minus me being slightly weak to it, but. You know, this isn't Pokemon, at least, so. Alright. Yeah, I th hey. think I'll switch out the Farcaster stuff after this one. I think that's when I'll do it. Cause what, I'll leave me like about 20-ish? Well no, I guess it'd be... What, four minutes? I don't know, I don't know how many I had it on there for. I'll have 20 plus Farcasters. I don't, I don't really need more than that, I feel like. Cause I very rarely use them. And, like, what do I even use them on? Like, Lunastra attacks on site, I know that much. Uh, Rajangs. Like, there's not a whole lot that just you land, they attack. Most you can land, and then you're, you know, you can just fast travel to a camp. And by the way, I'm waiting for, uh,. Like you wanna come down, so I'm honestly thinking for Greatsword. Would it be better for my Palico to have paralysis or sleep for status? Actually no, probably paralysis. If I can get multiple, like, charge attacks in, instead of just the true charge. Granted, the true charge will do double on the first hit, but... Yeah, that seems about right. Yeah, that's way faster. Well, I think it goes from 10 to 20% faster now. Like at level 3, I think it goes to 20% instead of 10. Open hit the head there, but it's fine. Nice. 
Nice. Oh, thank you. Kinda don't want that, but... Yeah, that's so much faster. Jeez. And we get a sleep, too. Casual, like, 170 on a missed attack, pretty much. Yeah, I should have just went into next charge attack through that. But once I get my earplug, I won't have to worry about that, and I can just attack through that. Yeah, fine. Can you roll, like, roll out of this? Like, out of elemental blights? I thought you could. dead already <laughs> I guess to be fair I did literally get two true charge slashes in one down because of the uh Grimmelkind was that Grimmelkinds? I don't know I don't know the names of half of that shit the things that was were holding it so I got two full true charge slashes I ain't actually no I got two full like all attacks were charged true charge slashes. Yeah, no, that takes way too long to go into the next thing, so because it was going in the true charge. Okay. I was kind of hoping for a... Uh... Alright. Oh, that's... yeah, makes sense. That was deserved, thousand percent. Yeah. Yeah. I can't really argue with that one. Just, you know, heal up though, as well. Huh? 
No, thank you. You know, you rarely ever do that move, but you've done that so many times in this hunt, and I don't get why. I, I killed with the weak hit of True Charge Slash. Did 26 damage. I think is what that said. Of course. Of course I did. Only needed a gem from Lyanna. If only. Oh well. That was Legiana. Not bad, not bad. Oh god, I just looked at the... Right, Lavasioth exists. Oh god. I mean, I guess at least I'm using a... F if, since I'm using a fire greatsword, is that gonna soften him up anyway? Cause I know shooting, uh, I know water weapons harden it faster, and I know that torch pods soften it. So do fire weapons soften them too? Because if they do, that'll be nice. And I guess that's one more reason to stick with, uh, Rathalo stuff for now. Because I think I'm just going to get that boring fight out of the way. Might as well. Might as well get it, Lavasioth out of here. I don't know that anyone likes Lavasioth. <laughs> I'll be honest. Um, do this for a little bit. I know I'm gonna need more bitter bugs, so I guess I'll do those as well. Yeah, good enough, I guess. Yeah. This, uh, probably not gonna be very enjoyable. At least True Charge Slash has, uh, Mind's Eye. Right? Like, if it's fully charged, I believe it does. So, I mean, there's that. Ugh. I don't know. All I know is I'm ready to not have a good time. <laughs> All right. Oh, wow. Wow. Isn't that like cool or something?
Okay. That was way too early. I really wish you would like sit still and not go into a small lane to fight in. <sighs> I'll be over here. Can you stop sucking? Okay. okay, so that's a no. Got it. Oh no. Wow. Anyway. I kind of really hope we don't see, like, either of the, like, if any of the Piscine, I think, Wyverns we see, I hope we see, uh, Beethotus of any of them, because the only one that didn't suck entirely. Granted, none of them were, like, great, but at least Beethotus was, no, not terrible. It's sad that that's the bar, but I think it's the best Piscine Wyvern they've made. Okay, I guess I'll just screw myself. Can you not suck? Like, genuine question.
Yeah, I know of the, the dome ledge thing now. Kind of figured that out. Now you're here? Like, really? I don't want anything to do with you. At least right now. Cool. No actual, like, knockdown attack. No. I've mounted you multiple times now. Not a single normal knockdown attack. What even was that? Look at you. Look at you go. I, just, I don't get how you can go from, like, I guess it's not really this, because this isn't like at all how the Vasyoth apparently fought when he was originally a thing. So how do you go from Jir Totus to this to Beatotus? Like, you went bad to worse than just, like, Kind of made everything not suck. That's gonna hurt. There we go, there's a little something. Hey, I don't even know where to hit on you. And frankly, I don't really fight you enough to really care that much, I'll be honest. But sometimes it feels nice. Most of the time it's just like, oh, that had no impact. Like it's like somewhere in the middle of your body, but like only sometimes. And I, like, I don't. 
Oh, okay. Now we get to play for like a minute now. Wow. Oh, you just decided to do that once, huh? There we go. There's a little damage. I didn't feel terrible to do. Oh no. Like, stop moving away. Good riddance, that's one last Slavasioth I ever have to hunt. Like, I feel like if that hunt ended literally 10 minutes ago, it still would have felt like it took too long. There's just nothing about that fight that doesn't feel bad. <laughs> like, same problem as your toad. This doesn't even do damage to be threatening. Everything he does is easily avoidable. Like... And then on top of that, it's like, oh yeah, it have an armor that makes you bounce all the time. Or just, if you do hit, just don't feel it. Because it's all a terrible hit zone. I feel like it's worse for, like, big impact weapons. Like, say, hammer or, uh, like, greatsword. Because, like, a lot of the really feeling good part of playing the weapon is when you land that big hit just like the the hit stop but when you don't get when you don't hit a good hit zone it feels weightless so that fight just feels terrible for light weapons it kind of still feels terrible because I know that always felt terrible for dual blades as well but, I don't know. I just think it's a terrible fight. I think it's kind of... The problem with is it's basically the opposite of what Girotodus does. Where it goes and gets its armor and it gets weaker when you break it. Lavasioth, you do less damage when it doesn't have lava armor, which is basically whenever it goes under, you know, underground, then you do less damage, whether that's by bouncing or just like, just a bad hit zone. It just feels terrible. But, yeah, enough of that. I'm going to do this. Um, I'll leave this for a little bit, I think. Yeah. Uh, let's... You know what, yeah, let's go for Basil. If I can get two Talons. If I can get two Talons, I can get... Um, the, like, you know, the 
talons. Power and armor talon. And then from there I can uh you know it'll be marginally but still more damage and armor. Figure why not. See in here? No he's not. See in here then. Uh yes. Alright. I guess the thing to point out is I actually prefer seething over this. I actually find regular basil to be annoying. Because of the fact that I don't like just area denial as a concept. I think there's much better ways to like make the player have to think on their feet. I think Air Age Nile is like the worst way to do it. There are good ways to implement it, but. So the issue is most of the time, how it's done, it doesn't really incentivize playing any different. It just incentivizes, okay, I'll just wait for that area to open up again. And then you just don't interact. Which then just makes it boring. Right. You suck. You first. Go for it. I guess don't mind if I do. <laughs> I mean, they had plenty of opportunity to move. Oh, he went like all the way up there, huh? Can you just not be annoying? Like, is that an option? I feel like is there Rathalos would literally be better if it was just Rathalos but blue. Okay, where are you? Okay, you're going down here now. Okay. It's been like two and a half minutes probably at this point and I still haven't even started a fight really Right, that's not gonna work for you at all because your shit explodes later. Right. There we go, there's some good damage there. Okay. 
There we go. Oh yeah, you get up way too fast, right. You're one of those monsters. I just have to skip my actual, like, opening. That's cool. Holy shit, you cannot dodge after that, like, at all. Reminder not to do that move like ever again. Alright. There goes your tail. You suck. Really? Why? Don't move your head so much. Doesn't even make sense. It's not even your head that's like doing the momentum. <laughs> oh, that's cool. I guess I needed one of those at some point. Guess it's okay that I got it now. Oh man, why does so- You really realize how many monsters move their head back so many, like, and how often by playing Great Sword? That is one thing I am learning a lot of. Okay. Are you just gonna- Oh, okay, you're just, you're just doing that. Okay, then. Welcome back. Oh, you suck. You didn't even look at me. And that hurt a lot. Yeah, I guess I just need to remember that tackling really doesn't work against you, like, at all. Because your shit explodes after you hit it, which would also imply hitting me. Right, I love getting staggered when you really didn't land near me, like at all.
forgot that you just drop shit everywhere. I always forget that. Cause you know, that's fun to deal with. Just random drops. You know what people like get mad at Kieran for being random? Well, it's literally not. But you dropping scales is literally random. So cool. Oh wait, it's boring? What? to watch where I'm going through this damn minefield. Like, I'm fine with Basil when he's in this mode. Because shit explodes instantly. Or like, you know... Pretty much when it drops. Like, that's what I'm talking about. I dodge an attack if I get hit by the explosion because, you know, it's delayed. That's, that's fun. It's like, what, what, what do you do there, then? You really don't have shit you can do. Uh, Alright. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's... that. That's why I would always prefer just... Seething. Because you don't have the... Uh, the dumb... Not enraged mode. And the ones that don't explode instantly, they take, like, 10 seconds to explode. It's like, you had to screw up to get hit by it. I'll take my free damage there. So I can go through here safe. Kinda. Can you, like, shut up? I know how that exploded, honestly. Why are you enraged? I've literally not touched you. <sighs> I hate invaders. They're no fun. Just leave. Cool, thanks.
I don't even know what that was. go you get up way too damn fast you need to slow that shit down <laughs> it's like less than five seconds Behold, the most overhyped monster in Monster Hunter. I don't get it. I'll never get it. It does nothing for me. Honestly, it takes away from the game for me. Oh, there those go. Alright, cool. Did I get any towns? Like, at all? I don't know if I got any. I don't think I did. Oh, I got two. Okay, cool. So I can actually craft those. Alright, cool. So power talon, armor talon. Alright, cool. Nice. Um... Let's go on a Rathalos, I guess. Why? Oh, actually, damn. It's actually about time to end this part. It's almost coming up on an hour and a half. So, actually, that's going to do it for this one. If you watch this on YouTube, I hope you enjoyed. Like, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And I will see you next time. See ya.